Barbara Ann Wagner. I'm 15 years old. I'm from here, here in Gonzales, and I'm going to do some singing for you guys as you eat and have some fun. And my first song is going to be a worship song. It's called What a Beautiful Name.
Alright, my next song is at last by in a gym. Check one, two. Testing, testing one, two.
or this month is Thanksgiving, and I thought if you wouldn't mind if I asked, oh, I can go so far. <laughs> uh, I thought I might ask a couple people to volunteer to tell me what they're thankful for. Anyone would like to come up and say what they're thankful for? I bet you there's somebody here. David, could you tell us what you're thankful for? I'm all thankful for everybody that's here today that could make it. And it's always good to see warm, smiling faces. Thank you, David. You know, this is a place... Um, when I first started helping volunteer with the, the Adventure Seeking Seniors, I was really getting depressed because I didn't know anyone here in town. And we've been here t almost 20 years. So when I started volunteering, it was me giving away, um, it was getting rid of my depression by giving to others. And I thought, this is such a wonderful place to, to do that, to serve one another and to show your love and care that you have for one another. I'm not Catholic, but I still love and still like to serve you. Even, um, we could do that. And anyone else who want to volunteer? Lillian, would you say something? What you're thankful for? I'm thankful for the community we live in. It's nice to be together with everyone. Thank you. Well, thank you. You know, share from your heart. We're, we're thankful that we can be here today. Just saying what, just um, adding to what uh, Lillian said, when my parents immigrated to California in 1959, they, they ended up in San Jose. I am so thankful that they got a job, my dad got a job in Gonzales at Rodriguez Dairy out on Fano Road. Remember that dairy? Thank God every day that I ended up in Gonzales and I'm not in San Jose. Nothing against San Jose. I have a lot of cousins and people in San Jose, but I thank God every morning I wake up in Gonzales and I feel safe and I have friends here. Over there is it's a lot of drama, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of cement, and not very much trees. <laughs> so I'm thankful they came to Gonzales. Amen. Would you like to tell me what you're thankful for? Very thankful for every day. I'm slowing down, but I just put one foot in front of the other. Anyone else like to volunteer and what they're thankful for? Other 
All right. Oh, oh. Got a ticker. Got a ticker. Everybody here with what they said, and I am so grateful most of all to my family, for all the people here, for living in Gonzales, for Barbara and for donating their time, and the people that have put this together. It's just wonderful. I thank you all. Happy Thanksgiving. I find it interesting. I um, didn't grow up in Gonzales. I'm from Southern California. And I find it really interesting, the bond that you people have that have lived here for so long. It's just um, a close-knit family, and I just am appreciative of all of your love and care that you have for one another. Well, I think we are close to that time. We're going to have um, Sister pray for us. Sisters, would you like to pray for us today? Come over here, let me hug you. Isn't she wonderful? Oh yeah. Heavenly Father, we want to praise and thank you for all our brothers and sisters who are gathered here. And today, as we are supposed to celebrate, and as we are celebrating at this moment a thanksgiving for the blessing that you have bestowed on each one of our brother and sister, we are grateful, Lord, for all who have worked tirelessly in order to give their best and bring joy and blessing to each one of us. Lord, you are so great, you manifest your love to us every day, from morning of our life till the setting of our years. You are a loving God who takes care of us. And today, with grateful heart, we offer our love and we share our love to, with each other. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you for all our friends who have gathered here. May your blessing rest on each one of them. And God bless you, my brothers and sisters, for this beautiful day. Amen. 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 I think the coffee is hot, so we'll be serving coffee. Thank you, Barbara. Of course. Thank you.
Um, I wish everyone a happy, wonderful Thanksgiving. Our plan is to continue coming once a month to help out with the musician and the uh, catering, the lunch, and to bring a box of uh, fresh fruits and vegetables from uh, food bank. So don't don't forget to grab your uh, your goodies. You need those to stay healthy for the rest of the week before Thanksgiving. So without further ado, I would like to introduce Veronica Placencia with the Blue Zones Project. So she's our spotlight speaker. If you give her your attention for a few minutes, she's going to tell you about this amazing program called the Blue Zones Project. All right.
this song is called Proud Mary by CCR.
first number. Let's see what we got. The first number, we'll just do the last four numbers. Nine, two, three, six. Nuevo, nueve, dos, tres, seis. That's you. Come on down. Come on down.
Maybe it's at the funeral, yeah. Okay, I'm sorry.